Because I would have kind of expected this to be my capital. But it's not. It must be their territory, in which case, who's the leader? Scorner. Oh jeez, I have to take that. Or is it just the fact that they own all of their territory, in which case, yeah, I need to go and fight them now. The Polabo Norse hybrid. Interesting. The nearest would be you. Which is suggesting that we sail forth. That army is right there. Also, the raiders are right here as well. They have almost 5,000 men there. There is no way in hell I can fight that. There we go. This one is done. We're enforcing those demands, which gets me a bunch of my territory back again. And what I think I may do here is just take all of their land, because screw these people. Oh, jeez, I have a lot of people in jail. Okay, so Count Rolder, or Roldother of Groningen. Revoke! Philippa of Lille. Yeah, you had the most to lose. Revoke. Jutta of Frisia. Revoke. Zutta of Cambrai. Revoke. Aki of Alborg. Revoke. Oversticht. Revoke. Vorbas. Revoke. That was you. So you still have one territory, but you're still in jail, so screw you. And then Annalise of Westfalen. Revoke. And you guys can basically rot in jail now. So the only ones that I might consider releasing. Why is Sinuswith in? I thought I released you. I'm mostly looking right now for people who are good at fighting. If I can release anyone that's a potential champion. Like you, Gottfried. Still in charge of territories, and that is unacceptable. Oh no, that would be a thing of tyranny. I don't want to do tyranny right now. Okay, so we now have a whole bunch of territories that we should give out to other people. Um, the ones in the Netherlands I'll probably keep for myself. But like Cambrai, which is in Brabant, uh, I'll give to somebody else. And these are going to go to people who I know can fight. You're married to him. I can give you some land though. Killing Moon's quite good. And this will mean that she is a countess in her own way. I think. So we're going to give you Cambrai.
Then Osnabrück. It's going to go to somebody with a lot of learning. You're the Prince, Prince Bishop of something. You have Paderborn. Still going to give it to you. Whoops. Oh, Paderborn was already a great temple. I've just given you extra land, made you stronger. Not exactly what I wanted to do in that case, but never mind. We still have a bunch more territories that I need to give away. Um, Orbas being one. This one's definitely going to go to someone who's good at fighting. So, Colbjorn, you can have this. Alborg. Again, somebody good at fighting. Drifa. Congratulations. And I also have a couple of Yaldums now, don't I? Westfalen and Frisia. I mean, the one that would make the most sense would be you. So let's make you the Earl of Westphalia. Which means you keep them under control. And then I also need to give... Rizia ...to someone. Let's give this to a steward, Ingbjorg. Good. And then that, I think, is going to let me change up some of my people now. Because, yeah, you're a 24. So we'll assign you. We don't have any other spies, but that's just because I don't like to promote those people. She is not a powerful vassal. That's interesting. I still kind of want her serving on the council, though. So you go ahead and take over as him. Plus, she's also super, super loyal. And then we have two powerful vassals. You're actually a pretty good diplomat. Smooth brain. So we'll go ahead and assign you to the Giesbrecht. You actually look the same. You just have a different hat. And we have one more powerful vassal. Which is you of Helra, but you're not very good. And we need to give away one more territory. Which I think is going to be Groningen. And this can go to another fighter. Othon. An overstick I'm keeping. Lille's further south, but Lille is in um, Flanders, which I want to keep. Flanders and Holland are like the, uh, the royal territories. Okay, so we have 2,700 troops. They still have a lot of men up here. I've got to go on the offensive, really. We could go and take off and now. Let's go and do that. <clears throat> the Troublemaker. Just a cat. Come on. And we gained several of our champions back again. So what I think I'm also going to do is, once we're in Holland, I'm going to split out oops, not the levies, champions. I wish there was a split all champions button. That would be nice. Disband you, send you there, and then raise everybody else. Actually quite a significant number. Right, because of all the new territories, of course. 
<clears throat> and Inya has given birth to another kid. This is going to be V2 Spoon. May you grow to be strong and wise. Uh, hello. Cool. Ranger goes up. We've taken another territory, so I really need to take Aachen as quickly as I possibly can. So we're going to put Othon in charge because he is a sieger. Unfortunately, they've just succeeded. Damn it. Well, I won two wars and lost one. I actually kept the majority of Denmark. The, the biggest loss here was Julich. So I should be able to get them back again relatively soon. Oh, I hate diplomacy. It's such a bad trait. Getting my ass handed to you in a defensive war, not even the primary target. It seems they're targeting me entirely. The player does tend to get targeted by the AI. For sure. Oh, did the stream go down? Stream just went down, talking to chat on chat by typing, because apparently that's still working. Oh, I think we're back. I think we're back. Hello, hello, hello. Okay, good. That was weird, just a momentary blip there. Internet blinking out, Twitch blinking out, something like that, probably. Okay, so, unfortunately, we did lose that second civil war because they managed to conquer most of... I've just realised they conquered most of Denmark, even though most of Denmark was, was owned by the other rebels. But apparently that still counts. But we're, we're, we're going to have some... Um, we're going to have some revenge to do. Your account? No. Oh, you're not my direct vassal anymore. In that case, yes, I will accept your ransom. At this point, if you can pay me, you can go, with the exception of you. I will take the tyranny. And you. Oh, God. Okay, so anyone else that's in jail be released for money otherwise they stay there right and then I got rid of Aarhus which I need to give to somebody else rather more loyal um let's go for I don't know another fighter yes let's do that let's go for you you're a bit more balanced you're Christian though never mind Okay, cool. So we didn't run out of money. I think I do want to now raise a runestone. 
to our mother. And we'll put this in Holland as the seat of our power. We gained a bunch of ransom, so money seems to be pouring back in again. Are there any things that we can upgrade? Yes, we can upgrade the barracks. Please do. And also in Lil. Although Lil is the, the place that we usually give away. You don't need fortifications. Let's replace that with something more useful like farms and fields. That seems good to me. We're also taking pastures, which isn't very useful. I for least out the barony of Slagas. See, the barony is a uh, is a castle province. That's actually useful. All right. So, what's the next goal? Sweden is still very much out of my grip. England's looking like they're having a few troubles. We were considering going after some of the Scottish and Irish. To see if we could start spreading also true to them. But maybe not just yet. I, th I feel like we still have quite a bit of work to do in consolidation. Wait. Oh, we must have lost Crown Authority when these guys won. Shoot. Discovered Giesbrecht obliges me to more money. And who is Giesbrecht? It's a you who don't like me because you consider me a tyrant. I think you should pay me more. Yes. Make it happen. Any chance of seeing the family tree? Sure, since I remember how you do that. Uh... That's Mordheim. We want the dynasty. Dynasty tree. Hasn't actually branched that much yet. This branch is basically dead already. Sinnerswith's side's doing rather better, even though she herself is in jail. I guess these three are doing okay. They've had a bunch. And how are we doing for Renown? Still rising slowly but surely. <coughs> Right, what are my councillors doing at the moment? You are no longer converting. You should continue to convert, especially the Catholics down here. Let's go and get Cologne converting. You're making me money, that's fine. You're disrupting schemes, that's fine. You're building up the army. I feel like I want you to train the Royal Guard again. You're doing domestic affairs to try to keep me from dying, and you're doing your thing. Okay, as I walk outside, I'm greeted by my sister, Princess Killing Moon, crouching beside Shadow, tenderly petting her head. It's quite the lovely cat you have, my lord. Darn right it is. Okay, so I guess we're going to go with the benevolent intent. Speaking of which, did we ever... actually sway your wife to the stage? No, it wasn't your wife. It's your wife. Why aren't you in court?
Oh, because you're visiting somebody. I see. Well, uh, oh no, I can't sway. Here we go. Because yes, you are still... Okonusko. Which hopefully will then allow us to convert you. Now, where is the... Ability to have two sway things going at once. It's this one, isn't it? Or is it Diplomat? Forced vassalization CP. That might actually help me in Scotland. Okay, maybe we should be training as a diplomat. Hmm. Huzzah! Yeah, let's... Let's go down the diplomat path. Yaviel Green, thank you very much for the subscription. Welcome to the Maudlings. Good to have you joining us. Adrienne's friendship. All his numerous attempts to curry my favour have not gone unnoticed. I cannot help but feel uh, irritated. Just leave me alone, dude. No means no. Not happening. Almost champion. A healthy rivalry between the metalsome fighters is to be expected. But the growing discord between Karl and Stein is souring the mood at court. Karl is widely regarded to be more skilled, but Stein clearly takes issue with the assertion. In the middle of an audience, the latter bursts into my throne room and clutching a short hilt, cries, Karl! Only one of us can claim to be the king's most skilled champion. Meet me outside, and I will settle the question. Carl replies nonchalantly, I would cut you to pieces where you stand if it was not for the presence of my lord, you wasteful knave. Apologize and I may spare your life. I better act quickly if this escalation is to be halted. Um. Twenty two versus twenty seven. Actually I just accidentally clicked on you. You're a thirty seven. I think he's probably actually the best one. The honourable adventurer. Ooh, you sound cool. Legendary Blade Master Berserker, and you're not even a fighter, you're, you're a steward. Brave, honest, and diligent. This guy is like the perfect Viking. Unfortunately, if I give him territory, I think he stays as a republic. But I'm going to do that because I want you to be a direct vassal. You're really good. Yeah, you are still a um, republic. Right, yes, I'm trying to deal with these two idiots. Um, you can fight it out. Good luck. May the best champion win. Fight for my pleasure. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, I... So you're a grand city, even though you gave Alkmaar up. Yeah. Oh, interesting. He 
He is who I need for an heir. Yeah, you can say that again. A curse undone. The twist and turns of fate have not always been to my advantage. Odin knows I was cursed the day I met Seal. Today, however, that curse lifted because she did. She did. This scheme does not seem to be going very quickly. Inga's pregnant again. So how long does my truce with you last? Three years, June 1001. Okay. Noted. Uh, the other thing which I am seriously considering about doing is trying to build some more territory. So you need a temple. Amsterdam could actually build its fourth holding. You have all three. You have all three. You have all three. You only have one. You have two. I think I'm going to put my fourth location here, and I think that Rotterdam is going to be a city. Because we are parochial. That is going to spend a lot of my money, but I think it's going to be money well spent. Our development here, meanwhile, is maxed out. Two yellow eyes follow me as I close the hallway, and a small meow breaks the silence as Shadow pounces for my ankle. She may be young, but she is nonetheless ferocious. And generous. Dan Markart can marry. Um, you're 27. Definitely matrilineal. You are a diplomat, so let's double down on that. Let's marry you off to Olav. Although Olav sucks at everything else. Yeah. Marry you to Olav. Matrilineal. When can I go to war with Sweden when I have a bigger army, which is not going to be under this ruler? They have 14,000 troops now. I have five. This ruler, unfortunately, is just garbage. He's really good at diplomacy, and yet he's the one that has had to deal with the biggest civil war. I just don't rate diplomacy in this game. Inga's given birth again. This is gonna be... Whoops. Shadow Guardian. Done. Maybe start an easy war against East Francia. That's not even that easy. I mean, at the moment, I just need to consolidate. I need to spend money to build up my, my holdings a bit. Joker just died. Grilla's given birth to another Maudling. This is going to be Walt. May you grow to be strong and wise. 